right, I'm here with Castellet LA head coach Jim Sides, student athletes at Jay Opeke and Deuce Walker. After a 60 to 59 loss to Azusa Pacific in an NCAA Division II West Region quarterfinal, uh, Coach Sai, if you just kind of give us first your thoughts on the game. Yeah, you know, first, uh, you know, all glory goes to God and Jesus. We're really just grateful to be here. And, uh, and uh, it's bigger than basketball. So whether win or lose, we're always going to glorify God in this program. And uh, I'm just uh, grateful for the guy on my left and right that just senior warriors. Uh, I love these guys and just just fierce, fierce competitors. And we just had a great year. And so uh, unfortunately, it's March Madness. And that's what happens uh, in these games. And uh, all credit go to the Azusa Pacific. Uh, they got the win, and, and, and they played a great game. But, uh, but these guys have nothing to hang their heads, heads about. What did you think the difference in tonight's game was? Well, we knew they were going to come and gimmick the game and try to steal it from us with the zone, and we struggled against it. We've been struggling to get zones uh, all year a little bit. That's kind of been our, our nemesis, and, and uh, we, uh, we need to attack. It takes a while for us to get going, so we just tried to speed the game up in the second half, but they tried to make us, uh, they wanted to slow us down because if it is a game and, and we're going, uh, they, they couldn't play against us that way. And so uh, they stole the game in the first half and we got a little bit too far down, but had a chance to win and, and didn't get it done. Yeah, Jay, what kind of got things turned around for you guys, do you think, in the second half? Um, I just think it was just, I mean, our hunger. Um, we knew we were better than our first half and I feel like we just wanted to come out and show that. Um, we just kind of turned up the pressure on them, and then that allowed us to just play play a lot faster because we're a fast-paced team. So getting turnovers and just moving the ball and just just finding open man. That's how we play. So I feel like in the second half we were playing a lot more like that than in the first. Did you guys kind of feel the energy in the gym when you caught up in the second half? Like, yeah, for sure. Stretch. It's a great feeling for sure, even though we lost. It was, and Deuce, you've been here through some lean times. How, how meaningful was this season to you? Uh, it was very meaningful. Um, like I said, I, I love this group of guys. Um, they're a fun, fun group to play with. Um, and I just, I feel like, um, you know, going into the game, like, I feel like we had a chance to take advantage of like the team that we played, we knew they were a slower paced team, and uh, but they they ended up changing the game a little bit for us. Coach, is it too early to be thinking big picture about I mean the breakthrough that your program made this season? Yeah, you know we're you know every year even in the lean years we've always wanted to win the league. And, you know, we want to get into the dance to, to, to try to win a national title. That's always the goal, always will be, as long as I'm coaching. So, um, and these guys just prove that if you believe in something and you go for it, that uh, great things can happen. And, and we're going to miss these two, but we're hoping that uh, the guys in the locker room can, can enhance the kind of heart that these two individuals had to, to lead us. They're, they're amazing, amazing people. They're amazing seniors, and uh, they have a lot to be proud about in, in their college career. Uh, Jay, what was your one year with the program like? You obviously made a huge impact here. Uh, it was, it was, it was been like no other. Just from like this, from the start, like when I came on my visit last um, spring, like the coaching staff is just very welcoming, just uh, understanding that this will only be, I would only have one year, and just trying to do the most out of this year. Um, I knew that the group coming in um, from last year is just a really good group. They just didn't have, um, they just did it. They just could have come up with it last year. But I feel like just coming in this year, we just I knew we were gonna have a good year. It just depends on how far we go. Um, it's just like I literally have not had a season like this with just like the coaching staff behind me and my teammates behind me so much. Where it's like I just feel like I'm playing pickup basketball in the sense of like. There's no pressure. It's just I just allow to be myself, play myself, play like how I feel like I should play. So that's it's just been wonderful, and I feel like I've grown a lot as a person and a player being here. And I can't do, I can't thank these guys enough. And so I appreciate everybody here. Open up any 
questions? Okay, thank you very much, you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you.